you are an ias officer sir 2014 batch sir you you are not in proper dress sir why i should hear you when you are not in the proper sir, dress sir sir i beg your pardon sir sir, sir. what sir sir uh, on program... reasonable doubt you can hang uh, somebody sir uh, Serial number nine, Kanchan Kumari versus the State of Bihar for the prisoner Sri Pramod Mishra. Lord Sri, in compliance of my Lord's order, ninth May, District Magistrate Madhya Pradesh Respondent number four is present in court. Lord Sri, which order? Lord ninth Sir. May order. There was a direction to appear in person, Lord Sri. Yes, sir. Who is the district magistrate, Lord? My lord, you are an IAS officer, sir. 2014 batch, sir. You 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 are not in proper dress, sir. Uh, sir, uh, I'm sorry, any, sir. Show me any exemption, sir. Where is the exemption for dress code, sir? Uh, I was been told that I must wear the tie. The, huh? I must wear the tie, sir. Otherwise. Huh? I'm in a formal uh, attire, sir. I, I, I beg your pardon, sir. Then why I should hear you when you are not in the proper court? Sir, sir, court. I beg your pardon, sir. Sir, sir, I'm sorry, sir, for that. Uh, that is the only word available. Sir, sir. Next time we'll be careful, sir. Uh, why, um, why, uh, what is this, sir? The Anganwari Sevika selection, uh, the, how did you come to the conclusion that it is a forged document? Sir, where is uh, this where is, is the a finding? Sir, sir, it's an old case, sir. My predecessor came to this conclusion, sir. Sir, there was a reasonable doubt because the school passing certificate. No, if it is reasonable doubt, you should uh, hold an inquiry, preliminary inquiry. Yes, and sir. And have you given an opportunity to the petitioner? Sir. Before declaring that uh, you have produced false document. Sir. What, sir? Sir, uh, inquiry was been ordered by the district magistrate, but inquiry, I am, I am afraid, sir, it was not been concluded. So, on the basis of this reasonable doubt, the order was been passed by the district. So, on program. reasonable doubt, you can hang uh, somebody? Sir, uh, of course not, sir. Uh, then, what is uh, the steps is required to be taken? Sir, inquiry must be concluded and uh, uh, there should be a proper evidence that the document is forged or not. Huh. So, it must have been concluded, sir. Concluded in what manner? Uh, sir, uh, the letter must have been given to the board examination, uh, examina uh, board which conducts the examination. The board would have said that this document is forced or not forced. Huh. They are and the only authority to say. And petitioner should be given an opportunity before uh, uh, passing any adverse order. Yeah, sir. Uh, opportunity has been given, sir, by the my predecessor. Show me the material. Uh, when the petitioner was given material, these uh, are the, all the forged documents, sir. Please ex give your explanation. Sir, they were present on my files at the multiple occasions. They were been present to the court, sir. And, uh, Not present, sir. Whether have you issued a notice asking the petitioner to give his explanation? These are the fake documents. Sir. Sir, sir opportunity was been given, sir, and notice was been issued, sir. sir. Opportunity in the sense, have you given material to the petitioner along with the show cause notice? These are the material which are fake. What is your explanation? Notice has been served, sir, but the material sir, along with it, sir, uh, I'm afraid, sir, that no such material was available. So I will set aside and remind the matter. You hold a proper inquiry. If uh, the petitioner, if uh, the petitioner's uh, documents are forged or a fake document in that event, uh, sir, take further action. Sir, yes, take down in the instant petition. My lord, petitioner has prayed for the following relief. Based upon uh, 1842, the following order was passed. Mr. So and so, the district collector, come district magistrate, Madhepur is present in the court. Up, after a perusal of the records, he submitted that uh, petitioner has not been provided an opportunity. That apart, there is no finding that the there is no concrete finding that the petitioner has furnished a forged document. Therefore, the petitioner has made out a prima facie case accordingly. The present petition is uh, uh, accordingly the impugned order dated so and so stands set aside. Uh, petition stands allowed. The concerned respondent, sorry, competent authority is hereby directed to proceed 
further in accordance with law in order to find out whether petitioner's documents are forged or not after giving a ample opportunity of hearing to the petitioner at every stage accordingly the petition stands for the above exercise shall be completed within a period of 3 months 3 months sufficient sir hmm oblige